Good day, grade 5. Welcome to our science class. I am teacher Joey, your virtual teacher for today. Today class, we will travel to another lesson in science. I know and I am sure that you are all excited for another fun-filled learning activities for today. So let us now begin. But wait class, before we start our discussion, try to find a nice and comfortable place inside your home where you can focus with your lesson. I want you to prepare yourself as well as your materials necessary for your study. Kindly bring out your pen and paper so that you could jot down some important notes needed for your learning. Always remember class that having knowledge is having a power. Good day everyone. Let's now move to our lesson which is already the second um, to the last lesson that we're going to discuss is about design a product out of local recyclable solid and liquid materials. In this lesson, you will master how to design a products out of local recyclable solid or liquid materials in making useful products. Specifically, this will help you to identify the 5 R's components of waste management, identify and describe ways on how to reuse and recycle waste materials, and compose a campaign material on proper waste disposal in school or in the community in community example like poster and slogan. We have a science trivia here. Did you know that if you throw away your aluminum cans, they can stay in that can form for up to 500 years or more? So recycling is the way to go. So, ibig sabihin yun class, huwag natin basta-basta itapo ng mga sirang aluminum natin sa bahay. So make a way to recycle them and use your creativity to make this aluminum a useful product. Recycling aluminum can help to save a great deal of energy. In fact, it's enough to run your home television for about 3 hours. So last meeting class, we discussed about the 5 hours in waste management. This time, describe the 5 hours techniques in waste management to in each item to minimize waste materials or products. So for our number one, limits or refuse the use of unnecessary materials. So what technique is that? Anyone? Very good, that is reduce. For item number two, it used the material for another purpose. So, what technique is that? Exactly, that is what you call reuse. So, let's now proceed to number three. Use the material for a processing into a new product. So, what is that? What technique is that? Okay, it is a recycle. Next item. Item number four, restore material to make it work again. So that technique is, yes, exactly, that is repair. And then for the last item, item number five, it take back or restore what has been used to a new material. That is recover. I have a picture here, class. What is shown in these pictures? Anyone? So this is a group of waste materials. It can be a non-biodegradable materials or a waste materials. So how can we manage waste materials? Why should we recycle these waste materials? And what benefits do we get from recycling? Before we can answer these questions, we should learn first what is what you call waste management. Waste management is refers to the practice of proper waste disposal. In addition, 
it involves collecting, processing, and managing waste product with the goal of what you call zero waste. So, yan yung pinaka-goal ng waste management para malinis lahat ng mga dumi sa ating mga palu paligid by means of what you call 5 R's techniques, segregation, and so forth and so on. Another one is that, what is this zero waste? So, ang zero waste, the conservation of all resources by means of responsible packaging, consumption, reuse, and recover of all products and waste materials without burning them and without discharges to the land, water, or air that threatens the environment or human health. So, yan ang ganda nung, nung programa. Ang ganda nung purpose ng zero waste na ito. Kasi, it helps a lot to make our environment clean and green. Another one, what is waste management? There are many ways or techniques to minimize waste of useful and valuable products. What are these? Ano kaya itong mga to? So, just like what you called it can be in the process of what you call sorting waste materials. And of course, we have what you call the 5 R's techniques. So, waste management is we can design product out of local recyclable materials in making useful products. What are these useful products? We have plastics that can be turned into something new. Pwede natin gawing decorations, paglagyan ng mga accessories, at pwede ring pencil case. So that is an example. We have also, we can save our planet Earth from piles of garbage that can cause pollution if we know how to manage the ways of useful materials. Materials such as magazine, newspapers, bottles, containers, wrappers, snack packages, and the likes are only few recyclable materials that can be used again. We can make money from these selling waste materials and we have benefits in practicing the zero waste management on living things and non-living things. Diba? Pagkakakitaan mo pa yung mga patapon na bagay na yan, kung we can make our own um, resourcefulness and creativity on how to make this um, patapon na bagay, this materi waste materials into making them a new product. So, let's focus on what you call recycle. So, recycle, it involves the collection and processing of materials that would be thrown away as trash and turns them into new product. So, why should we recycle these waste materials? And then, what benefits do we get from recycling? So, masasagot na natin yan. So, recycle reduces the waste materials sent from dumping areas or landfill. It results to the conservation of our natural resources. Just like lumber, plastic bottles, water, and other minerals. It also prevents pollution by reducing the need to collect new materials. What items can and cannot be recycled? Almost all materials can be recycled depending upon its physical condition. Just like a dry and wet, fragile and durable. Items that can be recycled include plastic bottles, newspaper or magazines, bottle jars, and clothes. Items that cannot be recycled include ceramics and plastic bags. So it is important that we put the right thing in the recycle bin. So remember class that when we put the wrong waste in the recycle bin, we will waste a lot of time in sorting it. 
So, do the right things and use the right bend. How can we practice proper waste disposal? We can practice through separating the biodegradable and non-biodegradable or we can also practice what you call the 5 R's technique. Just like we have the reduce, the recycle, the reuse, the recover, and the repair. Let's have an activity here about recycling. Now, what product can we make out of these recyclable materials? When we have plastic bottles, we have newspapers, we have um, bottle containers, and we have clothes. So, design a useful product that can be made from any of the following recyclable materials. We have the plastic, we have the cups of plastic bottles, we have tin cans, we have clothes, and we have newspapers or magazines. So, um, out of this what you call plastic bottle, you can make use of this or you can make this one. So, out of the cloth, you can make echo bags. Out of newspaper, you can make this way of ball pen or what you call a pen holder. When you have cups, plastic cups, you can make this vase of plants. So, how to start in making a useful products out from the recyclable materials found at home? So, take note of this, ha? Para malaman nyo on how to make recyclable materials found at home. So, be guided with the following. The first one is to what material is readily available in your home. So, tignan nyo kung ano yung nakaredy, yung patapon na na bagay na pwede nyo gamitin. Next is, what tools should I use in making my recyclable product? So, alam mo dapat, pag nakita mo na yung, yung, ano, yung item na gagamitin mong i-recycle, so you need to have your tools na ready to make a new product. So, number three, what steps should I do in making my products? So, mag-gather ka na ngayon ng data, paano mo magagawa yung product na yun na gagawin mo? And then number four, will be the product useful? And then number five, how will be my recycled product look like? So, that's the important thing you need to know. So, remember that you must create something useful out of those local recyclable solid liquid materials so better plan it carefully class what comes to your mind when you hear the word slogan or a poster so later on we will come up to make a campaign regarding about this um, proper waste disposal to make it to minimize zero waste management so, ang slogan is a short and striking memorable phrase. A slogan in waste management promotes techniques and practices that advocates proper waste disposal. Just like the, the example, don't trash our future recycle. When you refuse to reuse, it's the earth you abuse. Put waste in the right place. So, those are examples of what you call is slogan so these are the tips in writing a slogan the first one keep your slogan short and meaningful number two use a call to action words three think about whom you are speaking or referring to and then come up with as many slogan as you want and then choose the best one okay how about poster what is poster so, poster is a large notice or picture that you stick on a wall or board, often in order to promote something. Just like examples, we have this one, example of poster, this one, and this one. So, that are example of poster. So, tips in making a poster. Number one, your poster should attract attention. Two, make it simple and catchy. 3. Create your own fonts for poster design. 4. 
put ideas about proper waste disposal in using color and graphic elements. And then number five, maximize the space. So those are the tips already. So remember that through recycle, we help our environment and we enhance ourselves on how to be creative and innovative in the place we are living. In addition, as an individual, we need to know the importance of taking care of our environment and that is through recycle. So I know you are now ready to take this assessment. All you have to do is to read each item carefully, write through if the statement is correct and false if, it, if not. Good luck!